While the pandemic is challenging many to scale back their plans for celebrations this year, a recent Meyer customer survey found that some families are doing their best to treat their holiday as a chance to reinforce the spirit of Christmas. We have store director Emily Lynch this morning to talk with us about some of the trends that they've found. Good morning, Emily. Good morning, and thanks for having us today. So glad that you're with us as well. You know, this survey that you did, was it 1,200 shoppers? What did you ask them? Yeah, so correct. We surveyed 1,200 shoppers across the Midwest just to ask how COVID-19 pandemic has changed shopping habits. And you know, this week we really saw some of that come to life. Um, for example, while the survey told us gatherings would be smaller than normal, customers still did their best to spend just as much as they did last year. And even though that we had less guests, um, we saw shoppers have turkey and fixings and all the traditional Thanksgiving meals on their table of the season, but also steak, ribs, and other foods. It's got to be somewhat unnerving, especially for buyers and other people like that, because you, you base those things on what you've seen in the past, and we're such an unprecedented world right now. What about Black Friday? Uh, what, did, what did the survey say about those, those days and, the, and gifts in general? Yes, another trend um, that we're seeing so far is that kids may have the biggest Christmas surprises coming yet. And that's super exciting. Um, our holiday survey so, told us that 60% of our shoppers plan on spending less overall, except for those closest to them. With so many challenges for many this year, especially our kids with virtual learning, missed events, canceled activities, many parents and caregivers you know, seem to be saying that these kids deserve something special this season, and certainly we can all agree to that. And so we're certainly looking forward to some kids having some really big smiles this Christmas season. And we're getting some footage right now. I do see a Monopoly game with Baby Yoda's face on it. Baby Yoda's probably just going to take over the holiday, it seems like, especially for those kids. Hey, but for the grown-ups, that we had that maybe a vacation canceled or we had extra holiday money set aside for travel that we're not going to do. What, what are people spending that, that money that was budgeted for something else on? Yeah, we're also seeing that the holiday budget going towards adapting, you know, the lifestyle both inside and out for social distancing purposes. You know, the survey found that eight out of 10 customers expect to decorate as much or more than last year. You know, our stores are also recently seeing that we've had significant increases in space heaters, indoor fire logs, traditional firewood, um, and they're up as much as 70% from last year. That's, well, you're hitting close to home there. We, we bought a home with a fireplace that we still haven't made functional yet, but we wish we are considering it again this year, especially since we're spending so much time there. Hey, you know, finally, we saw a wonderful video yesterday about something that Meyer did to raise some spirits around Thanksgiving. Can you share what that showed for those who may not have seen it? Absolutely. Uh, we surprised a customer at every store that offers Meyer pickup. And we really wanted to show our appreciation for those customers who have trusted us to do their essential shopping, especially these last eight to 10 months, surprising them as they picked up their groceries in preparation for their Thanksgiving meals seemed like a great time for us to really do something special. And in addition to the customer uh, getting their free order, we also surprised our team member that shopped the order with a $100 Meyer gift card. So it was a really great way to start off the Black Friday week and we hope uh, that you can check out the video on Facebook later today. Yeah, you'll see a lot of smiling faces out there. And really quickly, over the holiday season, hours, will they be changing? Because it sounds like, according to your survey, we're all going to be doing some shopping. Yep, so we're still uh, across our chain. We're open at 6 a.m. till midnight. Um, and so, you know, we, we're running ads to better service our guests through uh, COVID-19 and really listen in terms of the feedback that we're receiving so that we're here to, to take care of their needs this holiday season. Emily, thank you so much for the time. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. You can learn more at Meyer.com or you can follow them all over social, Facebook, Twitter, and don't forget the Meyer mobile app.